Overlord is now able to export and transfer raster images from Illustrator to After Effects. If the image is linked to a local directory, Overlord will automatically import that image file into After Effects and place it in the same location of the active comp. If the image is embedded in the Illustrator document, it doesn't exist in a local directory. In this case, Overlord will automatically save the image in a directory relative to the open After Effects project file and import that image into After Effects. The image will be exported at two times scale and placed in the active After Effects comp at 50% scale to allow room for size adjustments without a loss in quality. By default, Overlord will save transferred images to an Overlord folder in the same directory as the After Effects project file. You can customize this image folder path in the system options of the After Effects extension. If the relative path checkbox is unchecked, or an After Effects project isn't open or hasn't been saved yet, Overlord will first ask where you would like to save the transferred image. Additionally, layers will be centered in the comp if the artboard size does not match the comp size. A new comp will be created if one isn't already open. New comps will be created using the frame rate of the open comp. Objects transferred while in isolation mode are now properly named in After Effects. And preference loading in the extension has been improved. That's it for this update. As always, thanks for your continued support. Head to battleaxe.co slash overlord to learn about all of Overlord's features, and stay tuned for more updates coming soon.